Hello. Today I will be talking about movie review number 341. And this movie is called Prisoners of the Ghost Ran. This is a 2021 film directed by Shimon Sono, which is spelled S I O N S O N O. Shimon Sono. This stars Nicolas Cage in it. And this is from all LJE films, pa Patriot Pictures, Untitled Entertainment, Booze Booze, Bang Bang Productions, Eleven All Studios, Saturn Films, and SYC Films. I saw this movie on September 22, 2021 at SD Videos, North Day 14 in North Day, Ohio. <clears throat> so, this movie takes place in the treacherous frontier city of Samurai Town where a ruthless bank robber gets sprung from jail by a wealthy warlord whose adopted granddaughter has gone missing. He offers the prisoner his freedom in exchange for retrieving the runaway. However, he is strapped into a leather suit that will self-destruct in five days. So the bandit sets off on a journey to find the young woman in his own pa path to redemption. So this is kind of like a western slash action film. This is like a neo noir movie, like a dark kind of movie, dark action, where Nidoris Cage's tale to praise a bank robber who does the opportunity to discover his own path to redemption when this wealthy warlord gives him the opportunity to rescue his granddaughter in exchange for his freedom. However, if he fails, he dies. And he is strapped into a level suit full of bombs and they include some of his arms, some of his weights, even on some of his other main wee body parts. And if he has a certain amount of days, he only has five days to find his granddaughter and return her to the wealthy warlord. If he doesn't, he will die. And so when he does discover where the young woman is, he also discovers something else his own path to redemption, as where the young woman is, he, the bank robber is going to help the people retake Samurai Town from the wealthy warlord. So I guess you can say the wealthy warlord is kind of like the main antagonist of the movie. I would probably say that. And there's a bunch of twists and surprises in the movie that I'm not going to say because of spoilers, but it is a good movie. Um, there's a lot of crazy stuff in it, so I would suggest probably isn't all isn't unrated, but I would give it like an all rating. But it's pretty good, honestly. And, like I said, there's definitely a lot of twists in it. And, I would say it's more of an independent film, rather than a big budget action film. And don't get me wrong, there is some action in it, but, on a small budget level, I would say. But don't check it out, guys. I believe it's on demand right now. Um, I believe anyway. So that's my movie review of Prisoners of the Ghost Ran. The Ghost Ran is something that will be explored in the movie. I don't want to reveal what it is because that's my the major plot line in the movie. But that's but that's my movie review of Prisoners of the Ghost Ran. Please stay tuned for my next movie review. Alright, goodbye.